Hi, it's Eric here, giving you a rundown on how projects work in Komodo 6.1. So first I'll open uh, one project. Django project that lives right here. And it looks like 6.0. When I double click on it, that project comes up. There's a related toolbox. I can add tools specific to that project, although it's empty right now. The change in 6.1 is we can bring in multiple projects at the same time. So here's my Komodo file, Komodo source code project. I can bring in a third one. Say I'll bring in a Rails project. The related files get opened, and there's all the tools that are associated with that project. Of course, I can close the project as well, like so. Another difference. Uh, as you see as well, if I double click on a project, it makes it active and it moves the place sidebar into that project's directory. If I just want to make a project active but not move it, there's that right click. We've also added a lot of uh, right click items, so Scope Control, Publishing for Komodo IDE, Show in Finder, uh, Exporting as a Package. Also, we've added structure, put structure back into projects, which you had in 5.1. You can create a new group. I'll just call it group one. I can add an existing file, or uh, like so. Example, I want to have my caps channel file at hand conveniently. There it is. Now, if I add an existing folder, let's say the doc folder, notice that I can't add anything to it. This is deliberate. If I want to see the contents of the doc folder, that's what the places panel is for. So again, the project area focuses on the properties of projects, places focuses on files and folders. But now you can group them, and of course these things nest. So I can put group two inside group one, and I can add files and folders to that as well. There's a slight change in the properties for a project. We've moved the import settings into the properties field. Otherwise, it says it worked before. You can also change this base directory here. So if you want that directory to point to another folder, that's where it's done here. So in a way, we just combined the two different kinds of properties for projects. And finally, in 6.0, this area functioned as a most recently used file manager. Well. Here's where you have the list of the most recently used file projects. And I can manage that list here. So I, by managing that list, let's say I want to remove one of those items. So I select the item I want to remove, click OK, and it no longer appears here. So we put in a lot of the features for projects into 6.1. Hope you get a chance to try them out and enjoy it. Thank you.